Hello and welcome to another Waframe video. Today, we'll go fishing on the plains. In this video, I will talk about the best spots, on where to catch rare fishes. Also, I will share to you where I usually fish, when I want to gain Ostron standings as quick as possible. Ok, let's begin. The first questions you'll definitely ask when you're new at fishing are, where do I start fishing and, when is the best time to fish? For starters, this pond right over here is the best spot to fish. When you just started fishing, you need to gain as much Ostron standings as quick as possible. And, I find fishing Mortis Lungfish at night, at this spot, the fastest way to do that. With the help of a previous hotfix, this pond's fish spawn rates has become better. In the past, it takes usually a minute or two before I see another fish spawn. But now, I rarely see this pond empty. If you bring a Smeeter Carvat, and a Resource Booster, then you'll definitely max out your Ostron standings really fast, as it can double, or even quadruple the fish you gain. Also, this is a great spot to catch those rare cuttle fishes. If you look closely, this pond has a lot of hot spots, or what we see as bubbly waters. Throw some cuttle baits on those bubbly waters, and you will surely catch some cuttles in no time. All in all, if you're looking to catch fish that leaves on ponds, or just starting to farm Ostron standings, then this is the perfect spot for you. Now, let's talk about fishes which leaves on lakes. For me, fishes that leaves on lakes are the hardest ones to catch, as most of the time, you'll need to throw in baits to make these fishes spawn. If you just started fishing or, just farming Ostron standings, then I highly suggest not to fish on the lake. There's just one lake on the plains, and it's located at the center. It may be big, but fishes don't spawn really often. You need to move around find a spot that has bubbly waters, and throw in some baits, before you see fishes appearing. It's inhabited by three species of fish. The first one is the char eel. This eel is pretty common in the lake. However, you really need to throw some peppered baits before you start seeing them. The second fish that you can catch is the moor fish. Like the char eel, you need to throw some peppered baits to catch this fish. However, more fish only spawn a day. And the last one is the norg. Now, I really can't show you a footage that I caught a norg, as I don't have the proper bait for it. But basically to catch one, you just throw norg baits on those bubbly waters. Take note this type of fish only spawn at night. Overall, I really can't say something good about the lake in terms of Ostron farming. It's a pretty bad spot for that purpose. You only farm fishes here for their unique parts, which you can use to craft your amps and saws. Lastly, I would like to give you a piece of advice in catching lake fishes. One is that, don't fish at the center, instead, fish on the sides of the lakes where there are hot spots. In my experience, I rarely see fishes spawning at the center of the lake. And to, always bring a bait, as this is the only way you can see those fishes much faster. Okay, we're done with lake fishes, let's proceed to fishes that you can catch on the oceans of the plains. First, let's discuss on where do I farm sea fishes. The best spot to catch this type of fish is here. Just see the description below for the map of the best spots for fishing later. Right now, this spot is the best for me, in terms of farming Ostron standings and catching rare sea fishes. So how do I farm Ostron here? The answer is quite simple, by catching Merc Rays. 
These sea fishes are really awesome in terms of ostron farming. As you can see, a small mercury can be traded for 500 ostrons, while the large ones can be traded for 1000 ostrons. However, if you just started fishing, I really advise that you don't start here, as you would need specific ingredients first, to craft a mercury bait. Also, you need to be a visitor to purchase this bait from Fisher High Look. To make a mercury bait, you need some trallic eyes, gupla spleen, some fish meats, and some mortis horn. Gupla and trallic can be found in this spot and, they actually have a pretty good spawn rate here. While the mortis horn, can be cut from a mortis lung fish, which you can find from that spot I have featured earlier in this video. So basically, that pond, is your starting point in fishing. All in all, this is the best spot for me to catch common, and rare ocean fishes like the mercrays or even the glapid. Also, this spot here is perfect for farming ostron standings if you already have those mercray baits. So that's it guys. Those were the best spots for me, to farm different types of fishes in the plains of Idolon, and as well as farming ostron standings. Hope that you enjoy this video and find it informative. If you did, please don't forget to hit that like button, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more Warframe videos. Thanks for watching.